Welcome back to Racing Boys. I'm Scott Trailer, live from the McCarthy Auto Group Studios here in Kansas City. You know, we've been doing this show for a long time. We've had a lot of great guests over the course of the last 17 years. One of my favorite, obviously, if not my favorite, up to this very moment, Chris Economaki. That tells you what kind of company this guy is in. Dave Despain joins us now, the host of the Dave Despain Show. Dave, how you doing, my friend? I'm, I'm honored already to be included in the same sentence as Chris Economaki, who is my hero, my mentor, and one of my all-time favorite people. Um, you had mentioned that uh, you hadn't been to the Chili Bowl. And it, let me just say, first of all, kudos to the staff over at Lucas Oil Productions from AFTV at the production they put together. Obviously, we, we do the prelim up to when you guys go live here at Racing Boys with our pay-per-view broadcast. But rave reviews about the broadcast, Mav TV and yourself, your first time there. Your thoughts of the Chili Bowl Nationals, first experience? The building, obviously, is the first thing you notice. It's just dazzling in its size. Racing is an expensive sport to televise well. Um and I say this not to blow smoke back at you, but I thought you guys did an excellent job at the Chili Bowl of give me what I want. You know, right. I, I'm sure there's no budget for 16 cameras, including <laughs> nine onboards, but give me what I want. Give me the basics. Give me the, you know, give me the meat of it. And that's exactly what the pay-per-view customer got for his or her, whatever it was, $99. Yeah. And that felt good to me at a number of different levels. Uh, number one, you know, my prediction 100 years ago that the internet was going to create that kind of opportunity uh, seems to have finally borne a little fruit. Um, but by the same token, part of my mind is saying, you know, if you look at what those guys did Monday through Saturday, whatever time we took over, and you look at what Mav did in the time that we did, and you look at what it cost to make it happen, the difference is breathtaking. Oh, no doubt. And so, so the problem is, how do you make the economic model work to put a lot of grassroots racing on television as we've traditionally known it? Mm -hmm. That's a tough one. That's a very tough one. But what you guys are doing, I think, is pioneering because what happens is the grassroots fan is so appreciative that somebody cares enough to make the effort to give them the chili bowl and all those other things that you do. They're going to they're going to they're going to support it. They're going to watch it or listen to it. They're going to appreciate it, and it's going to do what we want, which is maintain and build their interest and capture new people and, and all the rest of that. Thanks very much, Scott. I appreciate it. Uh, it's it's a great project. I'm very excited about it. I hope people will enjoy it as much as I've enjoyed sure. doing it. You guys keep up the good work. I appreciate this opportunity. All right, Dave. Thanks again. That's Dave Despain, again, the host of the Dave Despain Show. You can watch it here in the Midwest starting at 7 o'clock Central Time. We'll be back with more in a moment. Stay tuned.